learn how you can best deliver feedback that will result in a change of behaviour. Hi, I'm Darren Stevenson, Managing Director of Extend After School Care. In our last two videos, we focused on effective communication. If you haven't seen those videos yet, check out the description box below for the links. So, now that you've mastered effective communication, are you confident that you can give constructive feedback to a colleague or employee in the best possible way? With over 500 educators working in our after school care services, it is important that our senior management team have developed this skill. We have eight simple techniques that senior management team have found effective in delivering constructive feedback. Here's the first four. Ensure the environment is private and non-threatening. This might sound very obvious, but it is important to avoid that awkward experience when a fellow team member is humiliated in front of everyone else because the boss didn't think to move the conversation to a private environment. Don't be that boss. Ask questions. Before launching into your advice, find out the other point of view. Even if you're confident you know the answers, Giving the person an opportunity to explain their point of view can make all the difference. Give information. Now it's your turn to clearly share your own perspective. The meaning behind your reaction to the behaviour might be obvious to you, but may not be obvious to others. Think about how you will deliver your message. The worst thing you can do is to launch into an irrational spiel without thinking anything through. Maintain objectivity and take the opportunity to express understanding and find agreement wherever possible. So, that's four important techniques that you can take on board before giving constructive feedback. In a couple of weeks, We'll release part two of this series to discuss the final four techniques. Be sure to subscribe to this channel so you get instant access when that video becomes available. If you have a friend or colleague that you think will also find this video useful, I encourage you to share it by Twitter, Facebook and email. And I'll see you again in the next one.